The monks of the ancient royal city of Luang Prabang are having their morning wash. On the other side of the river lies the almost majestic Mekong Explorer. It is currently the most comfortable passenger ship on the northern Mekong. The crew are giving the ship a final buff before the guests come on board. The Mekong Explorer is a floating boutique hotel. The 16 rooms are decorated in colonial style with large panoramic windows. Some even have their own balcony. And all the cabins come with one special extra. The Mekong adventure of a lifetime. Guests on the Mekong Explorer are welcomed with the traditional Laotian Basi ceremony. Cotton threads are tied to wrists to bring good fortune and call back wandering spirits. The ancient rituals still practiced by the different ethnic groups reflect the cultural diversity of Laos. It's the first night aboard the Mekong Explorer for the tour group. Tomorrow morning they will experience one of the highlights of the voyage. The ancient royal capital Luang Prabang is a UNESCO World Heritage Site. The villas stemming from French colonial times, the monks strolling throughout the city streets and the natural serenity of the Laotians all contribute to the city's unique charm. Grilled bananas prepared on one side of the street, directly opposite a French cafe offers fresh croissants the Indochina of the past is still alive in Luang Prabang. But it is the city's Buddhist heritage that makes Luang Prabang so special. The roughly 30 Buddhist temples are today still the center of life for hundreds of monks. Their traditions are alive and well. For centuries, the monks have been the best craftsmen and builders of Luang Prabang. Even today, they help in the restoration of their temples and the preservation of their cultural heritage. <laughs> the 
The following morning, the Mekong Explorer sets off on its journey towards the north. The Mekong Explorer is the largest and most modern passenger ship in Laos. A pioneering journey through scarcely explored regions of the country. Lean back, relax, enjoy. The river cruise through the fascinating mountain scenery of northern Laos is an unforgettable experience. Getting to know the people and their country, without sacrificing any comfort, is the philosophy of Lerny Day's adventure tours. Excursions to villages along the Mekong are all part of the program. Here, passengers can learn something about the everyday lives of the Laotians. For many, this form of soft tourism has become an important source of income, allowing villagers to sell traditional wares such as hand-woven silk scarves. The Mekong Sun, built in 2006, was the first ship offering cabins to cruise the northern Mekong. It navigates between the capital Vientiane and the famous Golden Triangle. The atmosphere on board is comfortable and relaxed. There are only 14 cabins so usually only smaller groups sail with the Mekong Sun. The crew is preparing the breakfast buffet. The food on board is a mix of international cuisine and local specialities. The generous breakfast on deck is the perfect start to the day. Savoring good food, laughing, talking, all while enjoying the unparalleled views of the Mekong scenery. An unforgettable holiday experience. Villages, fishing boats and temples drift by. The journey on the Mekong Sun is relaxing and adventurous at the same time. The countryside of southern Laos is mostly dominated by rice. Hidden amongst the rice fields is one of Laos' most important archaeological sites. The temple ruins of Vat Pu.
The surviving structures date from Khmer times and are over 1,000 years old. The temples were originally dedicated to the Hindu god Shiva. Today, they are an important Buddhist center of worship. Here in southern Laos, the smallest of Lani Day's three passenger ships, the Mekong Islands, is underway. Passengers on this boutique ship explore the 4,000 islands region for between four to six days. The ship was built in 2009 and is the most comfortable of its kind on this stretch of the Mekong River. The 11 cabins offer the perfect mixture of comfort and coziness. The Mekong becomes much broader in southern Laos and branches off into dozens of smaller tributaries, forming one of the most remote and beautiful river landscapes in the world. Twilight on the Mekong. The fishermen are hauling in their nets. The mother of waters sustains millions in Southeast Asia. A journey on this river is a magical experience. The sights and sounds of the Mekong will remain for a long time in the memories of those who have sailed its waters.